our YouTube channel is for both the men and also for the women, both the male and the female. I made a video about the various facts you need to know about the penis and someone asks what are the facts about the clitoris too. We should also discuss that. Yes, I am going to discuss that. Good day, everyone and welcome back to Nurses Lecture Room YouTube channel. My name is Mercy Mary, popularly known as a nurse with a difference. And I make learning easy and accessible for all my viewers. Today, I'm going to be sharing with you the various facts about the clitoris. Yes, does it really have any reproductive function? Is it just there for decoration? What is it doing? I'm going to be sharing with you eight facts about this, this small structure that is found in the woman. But before we go into details in today's class, if you are new on our YouTube channel, if this is your first time on our YouTube channel, please click on that subscribe button, turn on that notification bell so you don't miss out. For all my returning subscribers, this is not Miss Mary saying thank you. Let's go. All right, welcome back. Like I earlier said, today we are going to be sharing with you facts about this clitoris. I believe as a woman and as a man who has a spouse, you will know what I'm talking about when I say clitoris. The clitoris is actually found in, it's a part of the female reproductive organ. It is found around that labia majora and labia minora. For the ladies, I believe you understand better. And for the men that have spouses or partners, they will understand where the clitoris is being located. So the first fact I have to share with you is that the clitoris is longer than you think. It's bigger than you think. Same way the man's penis is bigger than he thinks. The clitoris is about four inches. Let's just say four inches. Out of these four inches, about three inches is inside the woman's body. Three over four, like three inches is inside the mouth. It's just one inches, you can see. So three, three over four of the real woman's clitoris is inside her body. And it's just one over four that is being obvious. That's the first fact. Then the second fact I have to share with you is that the clitoris grow throughout life. Yes, it grows, it grows, it grows, it grows. It doesn't just remain where it is. Or like the men so that are worried about, oh, what should I use to increase the size the clitoris grows throughout life and also this clitoris um for the for women that have gotten to menopause they will notice that it is 2.5 large meter larger than it was before it is 2.5 times larger than it was before when they were teenagers the fact is women don't care about the size of their clitoris unlike the men that worry a lot about the size of of their pennies then the third fact i have to share with you is that the clitoris has about 8,000 nerve endings. Yes, they have about 8,000 sensitive nerves. They are very, very sensitive. They have 8,000. They're all like the men's own. They have more than the men. So they have 8,000 nerves, like 8,000 sensitive nerves there. Then that takes us to the fourth point about the clitoris. The clitoris has only one function. And the function is that it is for pleasure and naughtiness. It doesn't have any reproductive function. The clitoris is just for pleasure. It's just what? It's just for pleasure. It doesn't have any reproductive function. So pleasure because it has those sensitive, it, has, it is very, very sensitive. It's a sensitive organ. It's a sensitive gland. So it's very, very sensitive. So it's for pleasure. That's the fourth point. That takes us to the fifth point. The fifth point states that 50 to 75% of women get to orgasm by clitoral stimulation. 50 to 75 percent of women get to orgasm by clitoral stimulation that is by touching their clitoris that is when they get to orgasm most women don't get to orgasm when their clitoris is not touched then the sixth point i have to share with you is that all babies have the same genital tissues when they are conceived it's about when they are 12 weeks that's when they start differentiating into a boy's a, a man's um, genitalia and a female genitalia when they are conceived at the very beginning they have similar genitalia but at 12 weeks they start differentiating then the seventh point i have to share with you is that the clitoris varies in size and shape different women with their different types of um, clitoris. Yeah, different women with their different types of clitoris. Some are hidden, some are obvious, some are like just open. Why some require little stimulation to get stimulated, some require a lot of stimulation to get stimulated. So different women with their different type of um, clitoris. Then the last point I have to share with you is that it functions a lot like the penis. Yeah, it also swells when it is aroused. 
you know when the penis is aroused it swells it's um, it becomes bigger the clitoris also swells because there's also increased blood flow at that particular moment when it is aroused this clitoris also has a shaft it also has a foreskin it also has a gland so i made a video on female genital mutilation and explained the various uh, stages involved in mutilations and this mutilation in some villages they remove the clitoris like i explained for those that have not watched the video on female genital mutilation i'm going to be dropping the link in the description box below um personally i say no to female genital mutilation i say no to female genital mutilation if there's any culture any tradition that is being that this female genital mutilation is being practiced it is high time we stop it and allow both the man and woman enjoy sex because the clitoris the only function is for pleasure and when the clitoris is removed getting a woman to orgasm might be difficult yeah it might uh, be difficult yes that's all i have to share with you anyway thank you very much for staying tuned thank you very much for watching this video don't forget to like don't forget to subscribe and also don't forget to share with a friend if you got value for all my returning subscribers this is not Mary saying thank you bye and see you in our next video